Oh crap. Oh. Okay, that was one bus I could have got. Damn. Um, I didn't really see enough through. So yeah, just got up, got ready, sorted myself out. The only thing I didn't have, didn't do last night before I went to sleep was have a shave. Now I wanted to have a shave before I went to this training for my car, but yeah. So yeah, I'm waiting for a bus now. I don't know how long this is going to be today. I got my ID. I got my got my phone for the uh, things. Oh, I got my tablets on me. I got McDonald's voucher in case I get hungry. Oh, so hopefully this training is all good today. And then later, we've got to try and sort some stuff out. So guys, we are back. Oh man, a little bit scratchy, itchy here. My mum's coming up with my food. I think so anyway, I just heard her. Uh, so yeah. Okay, I have no idea. I thought I had my mum come up because she's bringing up my cup of tea and my sandwiches. Um, so yeah, there was a car crash in Woodage, an accident. Now, luckily, if, like after that, after that previous clip, uh, my sister rang me up and she was like, "By the way," because I spoke to her before. She was like, by the way, uh, there's been a car crash in Woolwich. I was like, oh, what? You've got to be kidding me. I was like, where? And she was like, oh, just somewhere in Woolwich. So I basically checked the post that it was on. Um, and I was like, oh, it's literally right at the ferry. Literally two stops after. I have to get off. Uh, so hopefully I don't damage my flipping things. It's an advert for YouTube. For one of my videos I'm about to watch now. With Captain Spark. All right. For all of you people who've ever gone on one of my Instagram car posts and been like, Hey, Jardon, you're parked over the line. You own a nice... <laughs> okay, not going to get into that. But, uh, yeah. I left here at half past. I got here dead on 10 o'clock when I had to. So luckily I weren't late, but I weren't early. I was just dead on time. I mean, I had to go through the building to go to another building. So I was there probably like a minute and a half later. But that's not the point. I still got there on time when I had to sign in okay so I'm not gonna go into details but sorted everything that I needed to it was all good after we finished because we finished a lot we only done a couple hours there today tomorrow onwards we're doing like six hours each day um, for the next two weeks apart from the weekends I think I'm not sure even if it is on the weekend wow well, don't matter I could do it everyone can do it um, I came outside spoke to my sister because she had to go to the hospital she can't, she can't find out what's wrong with her, um, like they can't find out what's wrong with her uh, wrist I think it is, so she had to go see someone about it, um, and my other sister, she has fibromyalgia, the thing is, she got told that she had that, how many months ago, about six, seven, maybe eight months ago, okay, maybe a little bit less, but she has fibromyalgia, and like she today got diagnosed with it, and it's like, so what, that whole time it's been bullshit or saying, so, uh, they're both at each other's house, like, their own houses. Um, and I'm standing there, and I'm like, okay, time to go home. Go home, watch some stuff, get get today rolled in. And then I'm walking along, and I'm like, you know, it is a little bit chilly. And I'm, I'm on my phone, playing a bit of Pokemon Go, and I'm like, it is chilly. So I was like, yesterday, since we went to Primark in Stratford, and there was these gloves that I wanted to get, but because of the line, it was too long. I'll see if they happened down here. They did. Four pound, pretty good deal. And they were so warm. So I was on the phone with my brother. I was like 15 minutes talking to him about like the test, about the people there. They're all nice pretty much. Uh, it weren't hard. We just had to fill out a few forms and that. Now we've got to do a booklet. It's crazy. And then, yeah, my mum's my like, because uh, I asked her if she could make me a cup of tea. She was like, yeah. I came in. She was like, by the way, I didn't take the tea bag out. Uh, no, I took the tea bag out just like you asked before. Even though before she didn't do it. Which kind of annoyed me. Um, plus it was cold. So, I mean, I, I don't mind drinking it cold, but like you know how it is, guys. You know how it is. And then... 
Uh, yeah, I decided to basically ask my mum if she could make me these things and bring them up. And she was like, yeah, be 15 minutes. It's been nearly 20 minutes. She's still ain't up here with my cup of tea and my food. Crazy. Uh, but apart from that, yeah. I I asked Ryan, like, I basically told Ryan, if it's alright with him, to take his dog, Ghost, later to go meet him from work. And then after that, later, we'll be able to watch some Smackdown. And he was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure I could do that. But, like, he had to go at the time because he was on the roof of the building, you know. Because that's his job, sorting that stuff with roofs. No, I'm joking. Um, but he was on the roof doing something. Don't know what he was doing for his job. But he had to go at that precise point and help someone. So I was like, okay, cool, speak to you later. Oh, there's a bird on my roof. On the flipping roof out there. I thought it was like a rat. So I had a long tail. And I was, like, I was looking. I was like. "That's a bird. And then I saw a bird here. But why would a bird be on the roof? Random. That's what happens. So yeah. See you in a bit guys. The dogs man. I just basically started to do this video. And then the dog started fighting. So obviously I deleted the video. Little shit bags. That wasn't the only reason. The only reason because my battery was bloody low. Ugh, and the fact is that they started flipping fighting because I, I was technically near the stairs. Alright, so, uh, yeah. We last left you off with uh, me going to meet the brother. I didn't actually go meet my brother. Because one, it was a lot colder, which I like the cold. Oh, let me just get rid of this. I like the cold. I love it. I love going outside when it's nice and cold. Especially like when you're running. You're, you're warm. The outside's cold. Your metabolism is it's all cold. It's all good. It's all fine. Um... Uh, so yeah, plus, Ghost, he was being a little shit and he kept barking at me, so I told him we weren't going out. That was the main reason to go down there and obviously show Ryan that Ghost is there and that he loves him so much. But instead, I basically thought, you know what, no. Instead, instead of going out, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait to a point where it's all Gucci. This. This is yesterday's video. Now, best thing about this video, Sidemen 20,000 versus 200. I'm not going to get into it, but you need to go to the Sidemen channel and watch it. Every Wednesday and every Sunday, I think it is, that they do it. Oh my god, their videos are amazing. You've got Orange Team, Purple Team. Orange Team right now have like the luxury place. It's all good. They have the best deal. When <laughs> the Purple Team, <laughs> Mini Minna, Ethan, Bazinga, and Big Star. One, two, three. Where did they go? They went to Benidorm. In a one-star hotel. They got the worst deal. But the best thing is they've been given instructions to pretty much go out and party. Get like loads of drinks. See a few things. Dirty kits. Um, man. Oh, it gets you so pumped. This And this is this is two hour. It's half nine now. This is a two hour video. And I'm already at one hour and 21 minutes. I've got 57 minutes. Yeah, 57 minutes left. No. What am I about? I've got 52 minutes left. I'm so dumb. Yeah, I've got 52 minutes left of this video. And then I've got four videos from today. I've literally caught up all my videos. Everything now. It's only half nine at night. I'm feeling good. Another thing. My old watch. Where was this found? I found my old watch. In my flipping jumper that I was wearing, as soon as I took it down, it was in there. I was like, oh my god, I've been, like, I've been trying to find this. Um, ooh. And the thing is, the one that I bought off eBay for a couple of quid, it's gone. I don't even know where it is. I don't know where it is. But I'm going to get a new watch at some point. I'm going to get rid of these right now. I'm going to get a new watch at some point, because I'm a nana granddad. Um... It's one that they got me ages ago, years and years ago. Can't remember what happened to it. But I, I don't even know the make of it. I don't even know if I have a photo of it or video of me wearing it. But it is. It's silver and gold and it, it brings me that memory and then memories back. Um, what else was I going to do? Uh, had me dinner today. That was very nice. Cheese beans with the sausages. Gang gang. Um... But literally, watching these videos, catching up with everything, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Tom's in the pub right now, and I'll, 
he, he sent a video of him like drinking in the pub and I was like Tom they're saying wrong with you you're either going grey or the light is apparently shining on you which obviously the light shining onto him from, from above so it looks like his hair is, his hair is white <laughs> and I was like Trump and you ain't even got that much hair you're balding and like he was telling me to shut up and I was like mate he needs to sort his stuff out Talk about me and my hair. This grows too fast and this grows too fast. I only had this cut from Woolwich how many weeks ago? Maybe a couple months, but come on man, my hair grows real fast. I don't like that. Normally I, I used to like let's just say if I can get it out now and basically I used to get gel in a bit and just like slice it up there. Get to the point where it's like that and then like slice it up. But obviously, becoming now, it's winter and everyone's wearing a hat. There's no point, is there? Um, this is just too hot. i just got to take a snip off here, snip off the side, and I'll be, be back to normal. And the best thing is, Woolwich, £8, they do a great deal. Um, which is good. So, next month, I'm going to get my money. I'm going to do that. Um, I'm actually going to go to the toilet now, which means I'm actually going to end this video here. Um, me and my brother, we did watch Smackdown. From last week, love the episode. Apart from what happened with Cain Velasquez and Rey Mysterio and his son and Brock Lesnar, the pile of crap. He's just a bully. He's just a big bully. <laughs> oh, best thing about saving money is like all I buy with my money for the month for my dinner and sometimes like lunch. It's just one pan meals. You don't have to be flip. You don't have to have a lot of money to buy certain things. Like, I only buy one pound meals and one pound pizzas and flipping baguettes and like mainly anything that's a pan. If I can get 50 items, 50 quid, that's what that will do me for the month, you know. Obviously, I'm living alone, right? I mean, I'm not living alone, but when I live alone, it'll be the same thing. But that means I'll have more money in the future to do whatever I want with. I'll still be going to the cinema every couple of days, I'll still be flipping, I'll still be on my phone plan. I am hopefully with a better deal soon. I mean, if I'm paying £22 a month for 20 gig unlimited calls and unlimited texts, I've had that for over two years now. I ain't even using 20, 20 gig each time. I'm using, like, literally, probably under five or six a month if it's just me. Sometimes I'll share it with my sisters and my brother. If we're out somewhere, I don't mind them connecting because I'm not using it that much. I don't know why, but I feel so good right now. I feel so good. Everything's falling into place. Everything's getting better. It's like I told Tom, because he was at the pub, and he was like, "No, nah, Matt, Matt's not here with me to draw to um to someone." Uh, it, it don't matter. Um, and he was like, "No, nah, he ain't got that much money." I was like, "Tom, I could buy like fifty pints if I wanted to right now, but I'm not gonna because I don't waste my money on alcohol or cigarettes." And I was like, "Trust me, next year when hopefully at the end of these two weeks I've got my card, it's all been sent off. I passed the exam, I've got my job." Literally, as soon as I've got my card, I am going to make an appointment to get my arm seen, because I still have to do that. I don't know how long it, I've talked to my sister about it, um, to get my arm done. Um, best thing about being universal credit is that I can get my teeth done as well, and my eyesight. That's the best thing about it. Um, uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? And I was telling Tom, like, trust me, once all this happens and I get my job with my brother like, on his building site, hopefully, or technically any labouring job that I can do because it's a CSCS card job. Um, like, literally, every money, every week, I'll have, like, the money that I'm getting a month now off Universal Credit is what I'm not even going to say to you. It's like, it's pretty much the same thing, but a week. That's what I'll be getting. And if that can last me a whole month as it is now, yeah, I'm living with mum and dad. But at a point where I basically get, let's say, five grand to go private and flip in, try and find my own place for like, hopefully six, seven, eight hundred quid a month. I'll still have like five hundred or six hundred a month, a month to do whatever I want with. That's paying all my little bits off, and I'll, I'll still have money in the end, you know. And then, like, obviously save up for a few holidays and stuff that I technically want in life and, or need. Uh, all this I don't need. I don't need that. No, I don't need that. To, I could just go out on my bike. I have my bike for a reason. That one I got at the point is because I didn't get a bike. 
and it was more efficient for me because I was staying in most of the time to use it. As well as, like, my sister. She ain't coming down here to use it. She paid half of it. What's the point? Like, I've, that's why I've got to talk to her. I can't use this right now, uh, my weight bench, because of my arm. I could well, I, I could use it on just one arm. What's the point of that? I could try with both. I mean, to be honest, like, I know my arm's got a lot better. Because normally I wouldn't be able to literally put my whole arm like, back here because it would hurt my shoulder, which right now it's doing. But that's because I'm rushing. Uh, I couldn't even reach my shoulder blade on this side with this arm. But now I can, and it's literally getting a lot better, so I'm feeling fit and fine. I still pick up Rocky sometimes, he still feels a little bit heavy. I've got to go outside, work on the fats. I've got to... Everything's falling into place. But guys, that's it. I'm not going to be too long. I've still got 52 minutes of this video, and literally, guys. Teamtrees.org. Six million trees, I think it is. All right, let's just... Uh, team trees. All right. Let's see how let's see how many trees it's up to. Okay, that's the last time I saw it. It was five point five. That was from earlier. Refresh. Wait, don't wanna, oh. Five point five. It's gone up three hundred k. Three hundred thousand extra trees. Uh, uh, basically, uh, dollars have been planted. Has anyone beaten Mr. Beast spot? No, because he done a hundred thousand. He thought, okay, can someone try and beat this? So someone done one hundred thousand and in one, <laughs> and then he done another one of one hundred thousand and two. <laughs> no one's beaten that yet. Uh... Oh, Vic Star is literally. I mean, he's a 10k, I already knew that, but he was further up on the list. A lot more people are getting, like, <laughs> 10,000, <000, laughs> Dan TDM, 10,001. <000 and> <laughs> Dan be a poor, poor kick. 10,009. <laughs> Man, all this to try and get to 20 million trees by, 20, uh, by January 1st, 2020, and in four days, just under five days, they've done near enough 6 million Mate, if it's six million each week, if it's let's say a million of flipping day, it's only gonna take twenty days really to get twenty million trees and like we need trees to survive. But if everyone gave up smoking and gave up on the plastics and everyone like just actually gave a crap about the earth and started treating it like their fucking home to live rather than treating it like a piece of crap. This world would get better. You see the blue ocean a bit more. Rivers would be a hell of a lot cleaner. Flipping, you'd see, you wouldn't see fishes on the sea flipping with plastic in their mouths and dying from it. People have even technically eaten fish and like found, like basically got bits of plastic out. Literally news articles and stuff. It's bad. It's really sad about this world right now. But that's that was our generation before. Right now. Our generation is making a difference. We're trying to make this world a better place. So I'm going to continue with the side being 20,000 versus 200 holiday, guys. I'll see you guys later. Have fun. Peace, like, subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'm going to upload today's video now instead of... Normally I'd do it in about an hour and a half, two hours. Near enough 12 o'clock-ish. But now I'm actually going to start doing them about half eight, nine o'clock-ish. Just to make it a lot easier. I'm getting it in my mind. Doing the videos. Alright, guys. Unfortunately, there's no cat in here. Princess is downstairs. Let's go get her. Who's daddy? Hiding. Yeah, come down and get Princess. She's in here. She's hiding in the cupboard. No oh, shits. Uh, no, t um, Prince is in Ryan's room now. So it's just it's just Jojo and Buster. I went I went near the freezer and Jojo, um, Rocky and Ghost started fighting again. Ah, oh, little shites. Hot place underneath, and she sat right there. Princess, come on, come on, come go upstairs, come on, come go. Come on. Princess, come on. Come on. Come on. Come. Are oh, you having a scratch? You having a scratch? Come on. 
All right, girl, we're gonna go. All right, come on. <laughs> come on. Princess, come on, girl. Go upstairs, get some treats. Hey. Come in. And she'll run up. Come, girl. Well, you don't want to come up, princess. Come on. Hey. Hey. Good girl. <laughs> My team <laughs> basically tried to catch her photo. Hello, do you want it in today's video? Oh. You bad, you didn't. Alright, let's try and give you some sweeties. Look at this. She's going crazy on it. Look, as soon as I pick this, what's this? This, this, this. Not going to give her that much. Quite that much. Apparently, ten of them dreamies is like three sausage rolls to cats. It's crazy. Well, them small sausage rolls, you know, the squared, say the long ones. So we're gonna go. <laughs> I love my cat, I love her. So guys, I'm gonna go. Peace out, like, subscribe. Tea tree, <laughs> tree te team trees dot org. Go to that. And also subscribe to the Sidemen channel. And if you want some Sidemen merch, go to sidemenclothing.com. See you guys later.